cancer, the number one killer in the United States. And until now, treatment options have been limited. But as Leslie Mouton explains, researchers are studying a revolutionary treatment for cancer patients and those at high risk like smokers, even if they are not yet showing signs of the disease. Susan Roney is a successful attorney and a partner in her law firm. She also has a loving family. But seven years ago, her life was forever changed. I was diagnosed with um, stage four lung cancer in January of 2009. I thought I had bronchitis, so it was an enormous shock. Roney says she didn't have any of the risk factors for lung cancer. I was otherwise healthy. I was a non-smoker. I was 50 years old. Now a revolutionary lung cancer vaccine may have the potential to significantly help people like Susan. Instead of going after the cancer directly, it goes after the growth factor and prevents the cancer from growing with the idea of turning the cancer really into a chronic disease. The vaccine, called Simovax, was developed in Cuba, where it's already in use. Dr. Kelvin Lee says the vaccine has already been shown to be effective. The uh, vaccine itself is inexpensive. It's easy to give. It's given as a shot once a month. It has very little toxicity, so patients really do very well with it. As for Susan, the lung cancer metastasized to her brain in the summer of 2015. But she is responding well to treatment. She's encouraged by news of the potential vaccine. The one thing that you need when you're diagnosed with cancer is hope. Because hope gets you, you know, keeps you going. Leslie Mouton, KSAT 12 News.